Welcome back to Dyson Sphere Program, folks. Quite a lot has been going on in between episodes. Uh, I have been pretty busy uh, scaling up our production, basically. Uh, that is what I've been doing, and I've been scaling it up quite a lot. So, these are our magnets now. Uh, five rows producing uh, 30 a second each. We have some more gears. We actually need more gears than we have, I think. But we are full pretty much all the time, so it's fine. Uh, then we have the electromagnetic coils. They have been scaled up as well. I fixed the production lines as well because I, uh, I'd i made a mistake. I, only half of them could be going because of the ingredients they needed. So I fixed that. And I also set up an extra tower, so we actually have three lines going in here, and two lines going in here. I think. One, two, three, no. Three, and... Three. Three and three. So, a total of six lines going. And then we have... Our uh, what are these guys called? Electric motors that has been scaled up as well because this can actually handle uh, having 30 in a line, so and having 60 output on the same belt. So that's what we have going here. And we have two of those, and then we have our uh, turbines, uh, electromagnetic turbines, which have also been scaled up, uh, doubled the length, and we are now completely full on them. So that is all very, very nice. This did mean that we needed some more power, so I added another belt around here of solar panels plus I up here on the North Pole or South Pole I'm not actually sure uh, I set up some solar panels up here so they will pretty much always be getting Sun so that is pretty darn good so now it's time to head back to the home planet and see if we can't get some better production going there and we're almost there already come on and when we get back we also need to start some research because there are things that I want to be researching. And here we are. Hello. Well, I'm actually thinking that, for instance, this entire thing can go away. And this entire thing can go away. This entire thing can go away. Because we're producing it in much larger quantities over on the other planet. This is just pitiful, really. So this can all stop. Let's do supply, supply. Supply. Supply, supply. Let's empty all these out. He's already supplying. So we can get a nice big area here where we can build something more useful. Now, research-wise, uh, we can't really do anything here except some relatively boring stuff. But over here, there is a lot that we can research. We can research the wave function interference for these uh, plane filters. So let's do that. We can queue up the quantum chips. Let's do that. We can queue up the gravity matrix. Let's do that. We can queue up 
quantum printing technology. And you go. Vertical launching silo. So we can start building a Dyson sphere. That goes into the queue as well. And that's it all over here. But over here we can also do the logistics carrier capacity. So let's queue that up. We can't do these yet. Vertical construction we can't do yet. We can do ray transmission efficiency times two. So let's just get that researched as well. So that's our research queue full. We can't do anything with the mech and we can't do universe exploration until we get the other things. So that is research going. Okie dokie. Now I want to make uh, these things, graviton lenses. For those we need diamonds and we need strange matter. So that's all good. We're going to need to increase our particle production, the particle container production. Where are they? Where's the particle container? Can't see it. There it is. So we're going to build a new one of those or expand the one that we have. Now, where is it? Is it this guy? No. No. Where is our particle container production? It's gonna need to be bigger than it is right now. Here it is. So let's head over here. It's right next door. All right, we have that thing. Very good. So even though we have quite a lot right now, we're going to need to scale it up. And we're going to need to scale up graphene as well, which means uh, scaling up on uh, fire ice production. But let's start here. We will... Oh, I don't have a lot of soil pile. Let's try and get some soil pile. We're going to get some more up here. And now we're out of... Foundations, but we have foundations right here. So let's grab those. How are we looking power-wise down here? We're fine, even though we're researching. We're absolutely fine. And we're researching fast. So what I'll do... Is cut this off. Um, let's see. 15 a minute these can make. The limiting factor is all of them. So it takes 4 seconds and takes two of each, so that means one of each every two seconds. That means half of each every second, which means we can actually set up 60 of these. Quantum chips unlocked, so 60 machines, and right now we have eight. So yeah, so let's, well, let's just do this real quick. I think I'd rather build that way. 
which means a lot more soil pile needed. So let's go get some. Well, that's 166,000. It's a start. And more foundations needed. Ooh, we don't have a lot of those. Right, we'll give that a little bit of time. I actually want... What? Uh, let's... Let's increase our production of these a little bit. Uh, go to there. Go to there. Go to there. What are we missing? We're missing something. to go the other way. Uh, like so. Power. There and there. We're missing stone, aren't we? Yeah, we're missing stone. Okay. All right, well, we'll have to fix that too. Let's dismantle all of this. Let's try and get a little building space here. It's not great, but it's a start. So we need two of each. So, gravity matrix researched. Very nice. That. Do that. And do that. Okay. Pull out as far as we can right now. Okay. And let's get some machines set up. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's start with that. Yeah. Uh, particle containers. There. We will get an output going.
Okay. And then we'll get some sorters going. There's the faster uh, construction assembler thing. Uh, I'm not sure I'm going to be using that because I kind of like the one that we have. Because it's... If you take a look... This one has a production speed of 1. This has a production speed of 1.5. It's a lot easier to calculate with 1. So that's why I'm thinking that these are fine. Okay. ones and some power three like that so now we're producing a bit more and we can have essentially have uh, 60 in a row here but I think we'll go with 15 in a row so let's try and landfill a bit more like that and we'll copy you. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So that'll be the length. And there. Okay, let's just quickly get this in. So, that's how we did it, yep. Yeah. And there, and graphene is running out, but I was aware of that. I was aware of that being an issue. So we have expanded this a little bit, but basically we've doubled it, right? Almost doubled it. And we'll be building it up even more. But our graphene production... Where's that? It's over here. somewhere I think I thought it was uh, is it over here instead yeah it's here all right research complete for the launch, vertical launch silos. So, graphene. We're gonna need a lot more of that. So basically we need to extend this a lot. Full on hydrogen there. All right, let's get over here. And 
And we're gonna need a lot more. Not you. You. We don't have a lot. Which kinda sucks. Uh, let's just grab the graphene and stick it in there. It's taken up un unnecessary space. All right. Do we have any chemical plants on us? Nope. All right, let me just uh, get some things together and then I'll be back. Right. So I have doubled up on graphene production here. Is it going to be enough? I doubt it. But we have space to put one more next to it so we can drupal it if we want. Uh, but it is going up right now. Kind of. So, that's a start. That's a start. And you know what? Uh, we do actually... Let's destroy that. Tell you to be graphene. Also, we'll put that in there. And then we can delete all this. And we can take this out. And let's do those there. Do we have them twice now? Okay, and then this can just come down here and go in. That's much better. So, graphene coming in. Quite a lot of it. For well, now, it will stop being completely full eventually. Or will it? Right. Ten, minus ten solar ray energy dissipation. Good. Actually, it's not. Stopping being completely full. Yeah, it is. It's just taking a while. Uh, we do have some graphene now. So that's good. What else did we need for these guys? Uh, this was for the particle containers, so that should be fine, I think. We need deuterium. And even though we are producing it up on the gas giant. I don't think we're producing enough. Let's just try and see if we can't find our deuterium uh, power plant. It's here. So we have enough deuterium. Uh, actually, remote storage. Now where are these coming from? I have no freaking idea. Not there. Is it these guys? No, that's the ones that we just made. It is like a long, slim line, as far as I recall. If I scroll past it, I'm sorry. Graphene just doubled. There we are. So we're full of de on deuterium right now. Completely full. So 
So you know what? I think we need some more of these. And we really should start making these in an assembler. Let's do that. Uh, you know what? We're going to be using deuterium for these things, right? So let's see if... This is enough. So we have the items that we need. These take eight seconds to make. Holy crap. So... The limiting factor is the deuterium. We need 10 of that. So... That would mean... that a full Mark III belt can carry 30 a second. That means that if it was a one second production time, then it would be one building they could supply. So they can supply eight buildings. No, if it was a one second production time, then they would be able to supply three buildings. So one line can supply 24 buildings. Okay, 24 buildings or 24 assemblers. Let's find somewhere where we can build that. Here. This is going to go away. So something like there. Let's grab some landfill. And do I have any? I have one. Okay. Let's build you there. that there. I think we're going to need to make this just a little bit wider. Okay, power. Now, the strange matter needs particle containers. Iron ingots and deuterium. I will supply the strange matter. I will do, let's say, 1500, 1500, and 10,000. Okay. So, if we pull deuterium out here, then we'll pull those out there, we'll pull those out there, and we'll pull deuterium out here as well. So that actually means that since we have two deuterium lines, that we could supply 48 buildings. Okay. Do we have 48 buildings? We do. So, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12. Let's start with 12. On each side. And we can double the length if we want. I 
And I didn't... Ah, so stupid. I keep doing that. We want strange matter. Which is... Oh. Strange matter is not made in these, are they? Particle colliders. Okay. That's new. We haven't tried those before. Okay. Uh, so, particle colliders. What do we need to make those? And what do they look like? So these guys, no, that's the fractionator. Particle collider. Can we even make them? Yeah, miniature particle collider. So for that we need frame material. Okay. So frame material is made in an assembler. From graphene, titanium, titanium alloy, and high purity silicon. So that's something that we'll need to set up. Yeah, we'll have to set that up as well. I suppose we could set up that right next door. Why not? I need some... Um, some towers. Let's just grab 20. So nice that you can just grab those things. So let's set up a tower here. Can we modify this a bit? We are out of soil pile. We need soil pile so bad. Um, all right, transportation. Somewhere like here will do. And we want to supply frame material. Frame material takes carbon nanotubes, titanium alloy, carbon nanotubes, titanium alloy, and high purity silicon. And we'll do that. We'll limit this to 100. Uh, limit this. Okay. Let's give you some power so that you are ready to go when we are ready to go. Now, this is made in an assembler. That's good. Uh, so, let's get this stuff out. Actually, let's first see. So it takes four carbon nanotubes. And it takes six seconds to produce. So every three seconds, that's two carbon nanotubes. So it's like point six six carbon nanotubes a second. Right, so if we set up sixty buildings, that should be fine. Do we need that many? I don't know. Can we keep up with that many? I don't know. But we're gonna set some up. So, not you, you. Carbon nanotubes. Uh, titanium alloy. High purity silicon. Carbon nanotubes. Okay. 
We may just start with 30 buildings. 15 on each side. Yeah, I think that will, that's what we'll do. So... One, two, three... Can we fit power in between there? No. So... That means... One, two, three... Two, three... Right, 12 is all there's room for right now. So, 12 it is. For now, anyway. Three, two, three, two, two, and three. Alright. Let's get this going all the way out. And we want a return. And again, I didn't. Ah! Okay. Uh, no. Copy the recipe. Okay. Do this number here. And come back. And then. Okay. And we need power. Wow, we can't even fit it in there? Okay, that sucks. Alright, I am going to need some soil pile. Just a little bit. It's 12.5k soil pile. How far will that get us? Far enough for 15, I think. So we need power in here. And then we can... One, two, three... So that's three, six, nine, twelve on each. Uh, it's not quite enough. Fifteen. Ah, uh, never mind. Never mind. We'll expand later if need be. And need will probably be. So. Here, down here. Uh, let's come out here like that, and some power. Okay. Then all we need is a ton of inserters, so I'll be right back. All right, all the sorters are in place, so let's do remote demand local. Storage, uh, local demand remote storage. Uh, we need some of you. Wow, we don't have any titanium alloy. That kind of sucks. Uh, local demand. 
Well, we have eight titanium alloy on the way. Eight. A whopping eight. Wait, do, don't we have any logistics vessels? No, we don't. So let's grab some of those. They are here, I think. Yep. Let's grab. I want around number 50. All right. Okay. Hey, we got three. So it's not exactly all springing to life, as I was hoping, but we're producing something. A little bit. A little bit. Let's take a quick look at our titanium alloy production. If I can find it. I think it's around here somewhere. No, that's not it. That's not it. No, no. Where the heck is the titanium alloy production? That's graphene. I think that it was somewhere around here, but apparently it's not. Uh, titanium alloy. Ooh, these guys are all dying. Where the heck is the titanium alloy production? All right, let me find it and I'll be back. Okay, so here is the titanium alloy production. And it's pitiful. It is pitiful. And we're actually missing steel for it. Uh, because we have the steel production there. We need to request steel. Steel demand. And what we'll do is bring the steel out here. And then we will upgrade all of that. That'll help some. Did it just slow down? I feel like it just slowed down. Let's try upgrading again. And let's upgrade you. Upgrade you. Upgrade you. And now we can just expand the titanium alloy production because we have plenty of sulfuric acid. Let's upgrade you for now. Okay, we are out of belt. Oh, we are belt. I have belt. I have 760 Mark twos. Okay. So. I think in between episodes I will upgrade our production here and then I'll see you in the next one.
So thank you very much for watching guys, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you next time.